Okay, example 6. A ball of mass 150 gram is attached to one end of a string of 1.1 meter. <laughs> Sorry, long. So the ball makes two revolutions per second in a horizontal circle. So this is a situation in which it is horizontal. Okay, so we did the the free body diagram so you shouldn't have any problem i keep saying that but if you do please please just uh let me know lah okay okay so this is the ball so we are looking horizontally lah okay so if it's horizontal mm, where is it mm, this one so this is the punya weight lepas to the tension of the string is just here lah Okay, so the direction of the acceleration is also pointing towards the center. Okay, so mg, this is the tension, this is the acceleration, centripetal acceleration. Okay, so the centripetal acceleration is just to let you know if the direction of the forces are following the direction of the acceleration, then it will be positive. Lah. Okay. So the mass is equal to 0 0.15 kilogram and then the length which is the radius of the horizontal circle is 1.1 meter and then it gave us the frequency which is 2 revolution per second 2 revolution per second which is it is actually mean it means that it is 2 hertz lah okay Okay, so we drew, we have finished drawing the free body diagram. Now we have to find the centripetal acceleration of the ball. So we know that centripetal acceleration is given as v square over r. Now we have the value of the radius. However, we do not have the value of v. Okay, so v can be calculated using the formula r omega, where omega is equal to two pi over t okay so it is basically 2 pi r over t okay so uh substitute lah dalam ni so acceleration is equal to no what is in dulu so v is equal to 13.8 meter per second okay so 13.8 square over r which is 1.1 you then get the centripetal acceleration to be equal to 173 meter per second right okay um for this one make sure you don't round round this off to 14 lah make sure you have three significant figures or at least two decimal places okay okay the past two oh don't forget to write towards the center of the circle okay okay lepas tu we have to find the magnitude of the tension in the string so the magnitude of the tension in this string can be calculated using the x component which is equal to mac okay where the total force at the x component is just the tension lah okay so tension is equal to m v square over Eh, what up like mv square? We have so the ac plus. So m a c. So m is just m substitute jala the value and then the centripetal acceleration. You should get 26 newton as the tension lah. Okay, boleh question example number six.